Good morning, Colts. I'm Anika Sophia. And I'm your other anchor, Zoe, and this is KTV for May 31st, 2024. I barely made it to school on time today. I was riding my bike, and my teacher made me do a bunch of extra things with my bike that took up a lot of time. Yeah, you need to follow the bike rules no matter what. You should always walk your bike on campus, park your bike in the bike rack, and lock it. Bike etiquette is important, I guess. I have to get here early, but if I rush to school, I'll forget my mid-class snack. You know eating in class is against the rules, right? We actually have a video for you mid-class snackers. Hey, you can't be eating in class. But I'm hungry. I didn't eat at break. Because you should only be eating on your breaks, not, not in your classes. Okay, whatever. Even though you can't eat in class, there are two other times we can eat break and lunch. Yeah, you're right. Anyways, do you know what the menu is for today? Because I forgot to bring my lunch. Oh, um, gee, not again. How do you keep forgetting? You know what? It doesn't even bother me. I don't know how I keep forgetting. I just get up too late and it goes over my head. Luckily, I just remembered what the lunch menu is. It's personal pizza, corn dogs, spicy chicken sandwiches, and the usual sandwiches and salads. Hey, do you think that professional athletes used to get school lunches or bring their own? I don't know, but speaking of sports, let's head over to Jasper in the corner and see what's happening. Welcome to the Sports Corner. Good morning, Colts. I'm your sports anchor, Dylan, and welcome to the Sports Corner. In sports news, the Pelham Valley beat Westside to go on around two of the playoffs and beat them by a score of 27-0. Wow. As the next game will be on Saturday at 4 p.m. at 2430 East Washington Street. In other sports news, the Seattle Mariners will be playing the Angels in Seattle at 7:10 p.m. Now back to the KTV studio. Thanks, Dylan. The sports are going on right now. Amazing. But do you know what's going on even better than the sports? The Digital Art Club. Oh, yeah. I heard that the Digital Art Club is looking for new members for next year. Be sure to ask Miss Amanda if you have any questions. The club runs Wednesdays after school from 2.30 to 3.30. Today's the last day to sign up, so make sure you sign up quick. Miss Amanda must work hard to keep the kids, help the kids learn about the Digital Art Club. I mean, I would say it probably gets hard sometimes. I agree. It can get challenging sometimes. I'll make sure to show appreciation to all the teachers. They're so hardworking and they have a lot of patience. I can't believe it's going to be really hot these next few days. Do you think students and teachers can focus properly in blazing hot weather? That's a good question. My guess is no. Let's go find out in the weather studio. I think my favorite kind of weather is when it's sunny outside, but there's a cool breeze. It's rainy. My favorite kind of weather is snowing. It's rainy. Welcome to the weather studio. Good morning, Colts. I'm your weather anchor, Lucila, and welcome back to the weather studio. The weather for the rest of the week will be sunny from today and Saturday, but partly cloudy on Sunday and Monday, with a temperature of 79 to 85 degrees. Now, be, now that will be some hot weather colds, so make sure you wear your sunscreen and sunglasses. Now once again, colds, what is something that is round in space and starts with the letter S? I'll give you three seconds. Three, two, one. The answer was the stars. Oh, you thought I was going to say the sun, didn't you, Colts? Well, I decided to change it up a bit. Well, anyways, that was a knee knocker, Colts. Now back to the KTV studio. I think that's all for KTV, Colts. Only one more KTV left. And, and that's KTV. KTV.